Winter storm of the season has a lot of people desperate to find someone to plow. WBZ's Beth Germano is live in Weston for us tonight. And Beth, good news here is still some options out there for you. Oh, yes, and the snowplow drivers are itching to get going since the last couple of seasons have not been so lucrative. Behind me, you can see the salt is at the ready. And while some may be dreading the coming snow, these drivers are hoping it is just the beginning of a whiter winter. A dead battery on his snowplow is not what Jacob Holyoke needs with a storm just days away. But let's face it, the truck has been sitting. Last year I made enough to cover costs, but nothing for, you know, anything else. But he hopes his fortunes will change starting this weekend. I didn't really believe it at first, you know, I thought, eh, maybe. But now, I mean, it's been cold the last couple days, so hopefully... Something turns out out of it. It's at least half of the business for Jay's property management in Bridgewater. And he has to make the investment in the vehicles along with insurance to keep them going, hoping for a return. So we'll make sure the connection's good. It's the same hope for Kevin Godek in Bridgewater, with three trucks ready to go on Sunday and the phone finally ringing with clients. He only hopes Mother Nature won't let him down. Well, the anticipation of uh, the storms happening and then after fueling up all the trucks and getting ready, um, you know, and then the storm fails. Worcester is expecting at least several inches of snow. Let's get the show on the road and get going. But we'll get going with still a shortage of snowplow drivers as the city's DPW commissioner urges patients with storm cleanup. Probably 10% short of where we had been pre-COVID. Um, and all that really means is that it's going to take us a little longer to do things. Jacob Holyoke is answering every post he sees in the area looking for snow removal help. And he'll be ready. If we get a good storm, definitely. People will call. And the phone has been ringing. He's got 75 clients lined up on Sunday, and he's still hoping for more. As for cities and towns still looking for snowplow drivers, well, there's some relief that the storm will come and go on Sunday, perhaps providing a little more time, a little less pressure to get it all done quickly. Reporting live from Weston, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News. Beth, thank you.